YouTube, man, what's good with y'all? You feel what I'm saying? The video had cut off, and I'm going to post this second one right here. You feel what I'm saying? As I was saying before the video cut off, you know, the devil's a liar. He don't want me to speak the truth. Y'all seen how that video just cut off? You know, I was talking about how, you know, social media wants, you know, you to think that these people who post these pictures every day are perfect. And I want you to know this. They're capping to you, bro. They ain't perfect. They're not living that best life. Behind closed doors, they're going through things, man. This is why it's destroying our generation. Because people are not authentic. People are not true. People are not real. They fake everything, bro. Y'all see the glow. Semen retention, God is good. Retain y'all seed so you can see through these Decepticons, so you can see through all these illusions that, you know, this matrix has put in our reality for us to think that it's real. Social media, bro, is just leading you astray. It's just leading you astray. They want you to be caught up on your follower count so that you don't, you know, focus on your actual purpose so that you don't actually love who you are because you don't have followers so you're not going to love yourself like that's what they want they want you to just be depressed because you don't have the followers because you don't have the, the clout bro fellas i want you to know this man this is the truth this is what they want you to feel like they want you to feel like crap this world bro the matrix the government they don't care about us they don't you know, if they did, all of these things would not be here to destroy us, bro. I'm telling y'all, man, you need to wake up. You need to see the truth in this in this world, man, or else you're going to be so lost. This is why I don't really mind having a social media platform. But I tell y'all to follow me on Instagram and all that, you know what I'm saying? Because obviously I'm building a brand on my channel. I'm building a community. I'm building something, you know, bigger than myself. It's not just for me. No, this is for the kingdom of God. So I definitely need to, you know, spread that. But I'm saying that, you know, if you are on social media, you know, most likely you're just looking at other people and like, wow, man, you know, I wish I was living this life. You know, you you look at people so-called doing things and you're probably not doing nothing. So you think you're, you're just a bum. You think you're not doing nothing. So you're just not nobody. And that's what that's exactly how they want you to think, man. I'm telling you. And if you think that way, your life is not going to be fun. You're going to think that you're nobody. You're going to think that, you know, you don't deserve nothing. And that's not the case. Stop looking at followers. Stop looking at even YouTubers that like we're above y'all, bro. We're not above y'all. You can do the same thing. I'm a humble guy. I can come on here and say that, man. I'm not above you. I'm here to help you. I'm here to inspire you to become better, to become great, man. SR gang, man. Where y'all at, man? Leave a like in the comment section, man. You know, leave, and then comment down below as well. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. You feel what I'm saying? Because we are taking flight. And I'm, I'm about to blow up. You're going to see me blow up next. Watch. People have been confirming it to me. I've been seeing signs. You know, God has been showing me in my dreams. You know, a lot of things are about to pop off for the chosen ones. Stop playing. I'm trying to tell you. We seen the truth. We seen what it takes to become great. We seen what it takes to become our true selves, man. You know, social media, most people who post those things, that's not them. That's not their true self. They're not going to show you who their true self is because they don't want to get judged. Today's society, people are scared of getting judged or people are scared to stop caring. They're scared, you know, and, and when you retain, you're going to notice, hey, I just don't care. I don't care if you want to follow me. I don't care if I got the followers or not. I know who I am. Man, in a comment section, say, I know who I am nah, nah, with fire emojis. You don't need social media to define you, bros. So, shows, bro, th this topic needs to be talk talked about even more because a lot of people are getting led astray because of the social media stuff, man. You know, they're, they're, they're using other people's so-called uh, clout views, all that to just make them egotistical and make them just, you know, hate another person because of that. And that shouldn't be the case. You think you think the most high wants you to hate on another person because they're getting more numbers or they're, you know, they're, they have more following than you. He doesn't want you to do that. Your time will come. I don't know why people hate. You know what I'm saying? You, 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 why, why don't you think to yourself, hey, my time will come. Let me just keep grinding. Let me just keep putting in the work. You know what I'm saying? Man, I don't hate on nobody. I don't care how many subscribers they got more than me. I don't hate on nobody or clout more than me. I don't hate on nobody because at the end of the day, I know my time will come. Whatever God says he's going to do, he's going to do. God is not a man that should lie. He is not a man that should lie. I repeat, God is not a man that should lie. If he says something's going to come into pass, it's going to come to pass. And nobody can stop it. I'll be trying to tell y'all, bro. I mean, I'm speaking right now. The Holy Spirit is let loose. Woo! Social media is destroying the youth. Stop letting that control your life. 
Stop letting your follower count control your life. Stop letting people tell you that you're lame because you don't got followers or you don't got clout or you don't got people who are supporting or you don't got just so-called friends in this world, man. You are set apart for a reason. God knows why he set you apart. Stop being mad about it. Stop, stop worrying about it. Just accept it. You feel what I'm saying? This is just straight facts. You know, I know you haven't had a video like this and really come in your in your reality that, you know, social media, what it's truly doing to you. We're on SR, we're on SEMA retention. I told you most of the relapses comes from social media because you see something provocative on social media every single day, bro. If you're a man, you're going to see something provocative on social media, even in real life. So it's going to do something to your mind. It's going to trigger your brain. You're a man. That's your primal instincts to look at a female and be like, okay, she looks good. What is, what, what is not okay is to look at her as a sex object. It's okay to look at a woman and be like, okay, she looks good. You know what I'm saying? She's pretty. She's beautiful. Beauty. That's okay. But don't sexualize her automatically. Don't just want to think in your mind, oh, I want to smash. I know as men, you know, we're visual, bruh. We look at her and be like, wow, she looks good. You feel me? <laughs> but we can't do that no more, man. You know, we got to mature up. We got to grow up. You know, just wanting to smash and pump and dump, smash and just leave them you know smash and just hit it and quit it or whatever they call it man that's all just bs that's just all leading you astray that's just you wasting your energy your time what you can actually be doing with your seed your life force you feel what i'm saying don't get deceived y'all tiktok instagram twitter uh facebook snapchat all of these websites and, and, and you know social media platforms they're all demonic bro they are they just want you to have you know a sense of doubt they want you to have this sense of fear that you're missing out you know I, i'm telling you what it is man you know I, bro i see things for what it is so when i come on here and i speak it's the holy spirit bro and i know people gonna feel it because you know I, i'm just letting it loose i'm just i'm just letting y'all hear the truth i'm just letting y'all know what it is man you know people don't really say who they people don't really say who they say they are people don't really act like the way they truly act behind closed doors i'll be trying to tell y'all bro you know what i'm saying I don't even got to put on a facade. I don't got to put on an act. You know, I'm going to come on here and be authentic. Have y'all ever seen your boy Nano Da So edit a video? I want you to answer that question. I've never edited a video. I've never, you know, I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't try to put on this act. I, I just be myself, bro. And this is what society lacks because of social media. People can't be themselves. TikTok is all, all the social media platforms is all about validation, attention seeking. That's what it's about women want your attention as a man they want your energy they post the provocative pictures just to get your seed they do it they do it i'm I, man they do it bro the devil don't want me to speak on this i ain't gonna give up i'm gonna keep pushing through the breakthrough is near you feel what i'm saying these pictures are getting posted for a reason these females have that jezebel succubus energy within them they want your seed bro you wonder why females hop from man to man from 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 digging stick to digging stick bro <laughs> that's a jezebel bro that's a sucky bus she's just taking your energy she's taking every man's energy she's sleeping with that's what she's doing she ain't doing nothing but just stealing your glow stealing your energy i'm telling you bro y'all gotta wake up and realize the truth man you feel me your boy not on the soul man just understand this y'all you're on SEMA retention. Notice and realize social media is, you know, destroying our generation. It's destroying, it's destroying the youth. I repeat, if you are not using social media to, to, to you know, to connect with somebody who's going to give you an opportunity, you have a business you want to fulfill, something that is going to benefit you on social media, if you, if you are not that person, then get off of social media. It's not for you. I'm just keeping it a buck. Because you, especially if you're trying to take this journey serious, you're going to fail. You're going to fail. That's why I don't really be on social media, dog. You know, some of y'all say, oh, no, nah, no, nah, just follow the right people. I do follow the right people. But I'm telling you, you know, all of these uh, social medias are controlled by the government. They're controlled by the elites. They're controlled by the higher ups. They can still control it and put something in your reality if they want to. They can still put something on your feed if they want to. No matter who you follow, you're still going to see something at the end of the day, bro. I I'm talking about all the social media apps, not just Instagram. No, every single social media app you can think of that you actually people use in today's society, bro. It's demonic, man. Because at the end of the day, they want you to get away from your true self. They want you to get away from who you truly are and who God has called you to be. You think God wanted you to make yourself, you know, be somebody who has followers? You know, he want, you think God wants you to put your life around followers? You're lost. That's not what God wants for you. And that's not what I want for you. So y'all need to wake up, man. See the truth. You know, 
I appreciate everybody who supports me, man. It's your boy Nano the Soul. If you want to donate, hey, it's all going to be the description down below. If you want to, you know, join my Discord, whatever you want to do to support me, go in the description just to, just to support me. It's free. You ain't got to do really nothing. That's what I'm saying. I love you at the end of the day, man. I'm just going to keep speaking my light. I'm going to keep speaking my truth because this is what I've been called to do. And it ain't ever going to stop. We finna blow up. Watch this, man. I'm telling y'all, bro. Amazing things coming up, man. You know what I'm saying? But I love y'all so much, bro. <laughs> Your boy, no, 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 swole. Man, I'm out, bro. <laughs>